In the day-to-day -day conversations I've had with people and in my observations of the world, I've come to notice that sometimes people have a little difficulty communicating, right? Sometimes people don't exactly understand what the other person is trying to say. And I find that this may be because when we're speaking, there seems to be a lack of punctuation. We use punctuation when we speak, when we write, but not when we speak. So, to rectify the situation, Mr. Borg invented a system he calls phonetic punctuation. In phonetic punctuation, we assign sounds to each of the punctuation marks that we use when writing. For example, a period would sound like this. <laughs> a hyphen would sound like this. <laughs> An exclamation point is a vertical dash with a period underneath. <laughs> a comma. A quotation mark are two commas put next to each other. <laughs> or if you happen to be left-handed. <laughs> question mark, this is a tough one. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, our friends, the colon. Colon, two periods put on top of each other, underneath each other, or wherever else you'd like to put them. <laughs> All right? So, uh, to see how phonetic punctuation would sound when used in everyday language, I brought along this book with me. And so, uh, let's read a passage and see what it would sound like, shall we? In the open window, there suddenly came light. <laughs> Beautiful Eleanor sat alone dreaming of but one thing. <laughs> Two years had passed since she met Sir Henry. <laughs> she could still remember the unhappy evening when her father had thrown him <laughs> they had been sitting in the park, and Henry had said, Psst, darlings! <laughs> <laughs> Is this the first time you have loved? <laughs> <laughs> Eleanor answered, Psst, yes. Psst. But it is so wonderful that I hope it shall not be the last. He 
was a third little Levenant in the U.S. Air Fives. <laughs> Bob had been fond of Anna, his one and a half sister, ever since she saw the light of day for the second time. They were both proud of the fact that two of his five fathers had been among the pre nighters of the U.S. Constitution. <laughs> Three to loo, three to loo. 